Applying all the passive cooling techniques in our project. Passive cooling is a building design approach that focuses on heat gain, control and heat dissipation. Building configuration, site layout and site planning. We designed our bedrooms at least in minimalistic way to prevent less heat consumption. Corner view perspective. Building facade. Using this technique to understand and adding more aesthetic factors in our building which gives an eye-catching for the viewers. Formal garden. Hot garden. This is our typical bedroom, quantity of rooms to do. By using low E glasses, for our windows to coat the reflection bounds back to the heat to its source. So it helps our project to stay cooler in the summer and warmer condition. Cross ventilation. Air plays a vital role in recycling one of Earth's most important substances. Also is the process in which air is supplied and removed from an indoor space by natural means without the use of a fan or other mechanical systems. This is our master's bedroom. Quantity of rooms. 1. This is our living area. Quantity of space requirement. 1. This is our carport. Quantity of car space. 2. Normal perspective. Sunshading devices are generally used on the east-facing and west-facing sides of a building. Some of our trees can use as covers to prevent direct sunlight. White roofing, painted with solar reflective white coating and reflects up to 90% of sunlight. Building orientation, but we decided to place our kitchen from east to give such natural lighting and our rooms are located at west because of the sunset. Sustainable materials. By using some materials like wood corks, wood floors, wood cladding, stone works and etc. To make our building more aesthetically and has the factor to give you a warm welcome. Also we use some steel posts to support our balcony at the second floor of our building to give cover for the attached balcony of our master's bedroom. Thank you for watching.